right everybody thanks for watching please hit subscribe so you can and also the bell so you can get all the notifications yeah that sun was definitely blinding so i had to go get my shades anyway thanks for subscribing or about to be subscribing uh, if you want to hit the bell you'll get all the notifications you know you want to hit the bell and uh, anyway today we are going to be filling a hole that Jack dug we were on the honeymoon and he just decided to do what beagles do and dig a giant hole <laughs> and uh, so we're gonna be filling that in today I know buddy I know are you sorry Jack are you sorry it's okay, I forgive you, buddy. I know. I feel like I definitely need to clarify that my wife and I were on the honeymoon, not Jack and I. All right, let's fix this hole. So this is what I'm talking about. As you can see, it's pretty deep. And now Jack is hiding from me. He knows what he did. I'm sure that his brother Vinny definitely played a pretty big part in this. Look how innocent he looks. He's acting like he didn't even dig that hole. What? Are you going to help me fix it, Jack? Yeah, I didn't think so. Okay, big surprise. Jack is not going to help me fix this hole. That's fine. <laughs> uh, so you saw how it looks and basically all I got was some river rock and some all-purpose sand. And the all-purpose sand is what we're gonna put down first. Okay, so that's just one bag of sand. Just kind of threw it down in there. And what we wanna do just kind of try to spread it around, level it out, pack it down in there. And we're definitely gonna need more sand. Good thing we got five bags. Okay, second bag of sand is down. So we're just gonna continue trying to level it out. we do to make sure that we pack it all in okay so we got the sand all nice and packed and level and it's looking pretty good so I think we're ready to move on I see you Jack Look at him. Come help me fix this hole, buddy. I mean, Jack just keeps staring at me. And I know that he just wants to dig all this up again. I know he does. And the sand, again, that we're using is all-purpose sand just from Menards. You can use it for, I mean, you know, like a sandbox for your kid or... Clearly I'm using it to fill a hole that my dog dug. I mean, you can use it for anything. Okay, the next step after that is to just put down some weed barrier. See, I just kind of cut it to form it, put some rocks over it because it's pretty windy over here and it kept blowing all over the place. I had to chase it all across the yard. And the last and final step is to just throw down the river rock and smooth it out. It'll look like nothing was ever even there or that nothing ever happened to it. Heh, <laughs> you know what I mean. And so here we go. Bag number one is down. Bag number two.
And this is the easy part. You just want to not see any of the weed barrier. So just kind of smooth it around. Smooth it around. All right, we got the rocks all smoothed out. Everything looks pretty good. Okay, just to let everyone know, for this project, it took two bags of all-purpose sand and three bags of river rock. And again, you can get them from any local hardware store. I got mine from Menards, uh, and it was pretty reasonably, reasonably priced. Uh, so, very easy to get, very easy to do. Don't forget to hit the bell.